journalist was killed last night. What journalist? Artie from Midday. <gasps> Artie was killed! <gasps> Anya Zueva, good girls stay home at night, not in other people's apartments. What happened here? Tell me. Cocaine, right? Yes, cocaine. Why did you kill him, huh? What? He's been killed? Published the article that Majewski wrote, otherwise you will regret it. I am not impressed by the prospect of finding the corpse of a nosy journalist. Dilna says that I will kill you, huh? You did. We'll go now. If there's food in the fridge, you'll sleep here. Freeze! Uh, uh, Hands on the wall! Don't move! Oh. Now you say it's not yours? Hey, stop! Move! Ah! Wait! Wait! Garrick! Stop right there, I'm telling you! Case for two. Part six. Hey. You. <laughs> you did not expect this kind of surprise, huh? <laughs> what are you doing, airhead? Oh. Easy, man. It's okay. You're gonna be here for a long time. So stay there, pig. <laughs> hey, where are you going? You know too much. You will die soon. about anything cool that happened. This is no reason to worry. Do you understand that he isn't at work or at home for two days in a row? And yeah, did, did you made up? Yes, we did. Everything was fine and then he went somewhere. I don't know, he texted me. I'm going to check something on the Majewski case and that's all, I assure you. Why didn't you tell me? We have to go there. And we're running out of time. Where to go? I don't know where. And I don't know where. I don't know where to go. The only thing I know is that he went together with a guy and a young man was here. What man? Him, he came with him. He was with, um... Yeah, uh, he was with Garrick. Maybe. Well, let's look for Garrick. I know where he can be. Right now? Yes, now. At 2 a.m.? At 2 a.m. He may know where Paul is. Maybe he will come now. Maybe he's in an ambush. Hey, stop talking. Let's go now. You want to talk? Okay, let's talk. Listen, I heard you were interested in Majewski. I can tell you, I have nothing to do with it. I really don't know who killed him. Why should I believe you? <laughs> believe it or not, Artie was our man. We also want to know who killed him. Who are we? Man, let's do this. You don't touch us. And we... 
will help you. What about Maevsky's article? The threats to journalists. Were you doing this? Are you worried about you journalist? You just think about yourself now. And the article, yeah. This is the way to finish with enemies in business. Can you dig it now? I'm not so sure. Let's say I believe you and we'll have a deal. <laughs> Aren't you afraid that I'll put you in jail later? <laughs> then I will have to do something about it. Well, do we have a deal? Come on. I don't think so. Next time, I will have a heart-to-heart -heart talk with you. In the detention center. It's a pity I wanted to make this easy for you, but you just don't get it. For me? What, someone should? Why are you nervous? No reason, listen. Remember you borrowed money from me? Uh, can you... Can I... Have it back now? What, do you really need it? Yeah. Oof. Wait a second, I have to go out. Uh-huh. What do you want? Let's talk outside. I'm not going anywhere. Tell me where Paul Demian is and I will leave you alone. How would I know where this Paul Demian is? Where's Paul Demian? Are you crazy or what? One more time, where is Demian? Should I call security? Okay, as you wish. Here you go. It's not all of it. I will have the rest in a couple of days, okay? Okay. What happened? He knows something, I'm sure of it. <laughs> what? Are you bored? I'm tired of your face already. You will be even more tired now. What are you doing? You still don't know where you are. will hurt. You'll die in prison. You know they're looking for me. I get it. This is what I'm doing right now. Can you imagine, Cup? They will look for you for a day or two and find you in a drug intoxication. And everyone will say, our healthy lifestyle chief is a drug addict. Come on, come on, Cup. You're mine now. Got it? Who will believe it? Got it? I am... Uh, uh, yeah. Uh, that thing's special. <sighs> Who will believe you now? Uh, well... We will plant evidence in your place so you know... You will be put in jail... For a long time, pig. You freak. Easy. Come on, get in. Go, go, go. What are you doing? 
You again? Me again. What do you want from me? Where is Paul Damien? What Damien? You left the station together last time. What station? I don't understand what you guys are talking about. Stop lying. You were seen together and I saw the bartender gave you money. Why do you need the money? Do you want to get out of the city or what? Where is Paul? Tell me now! Of course, this is my area. We knew each other. He'd ask my advice in other matters. If there's any news about this case, call me, okay? This is my card. I would really appreciate it. What is it? Shoes. Face down. I said face down. Sivu. Him, contact him somehow. I have nothing to do with it. Okay, wait. Help him. What? What are you doing? You're letting him go? Garrick. Your name is Garrick, right? Yeah, Garrick. Your last name? Sakin. <sighs> Tell me, Garrick Sakin, do you have special marks on your body? Well, like. A tattoo, maybe? Anything? I have a tattoo. Show it to me. <sighs> yeah, good. <clears throat> That's it, I remember. There are other corpses involved in the case. I don't want to waste time on identification, but no. If I see the dead one with the scorpion in hand, I know for sure. This is Mr. Garen Sakin. Okay, go now. Go, go. Dismissed, go, go. No, guys, wait a minute. I'm not an idiot, you know. Hmm. So tell me. Excellent. Where is Paul? We were together. Here is the deal and they let me go. That's all I know. I don't know anything else. Who is Dylan? Where does he live? What does he do? Dylan? A local dealer. He sells drugs. Where he lives? I don't know. I, I was once in his house, but I wasn't drugs. Can you find his place now? Uh, I don't know. I'm not sure. Hey, let's go. Hey, hello, my friend. <laughs> my friend. Are you having fun? Now will be even better. Where is your friend, Sivun? Hey, cop. You're confused. Sivun is just like you. He's lying in the next room. I got it. He cut the wheel in my car so that you could run away. Sivun just did it. Is he covering for you? I know he is. What are you saying? I can see you get hit pretty good, right? Hey. <laughs> Why are you... It's okay, it's okay. He is smart. He is smarter than I thought. Right, Paul? Yeah. <sighs> you took the coke from Mayevsky's apartment. You stole it. Why don't we work together? <laughs> It'll be cool. Yeah, I'm all ready. Enjoying our cooperation. Go see. Uh, 
you have a very fun circus here. What, did you like it? I said we'd have fun. <laughs> huh? Don't move! Uh, 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 uh. Who are you? What are you doing here? How... How did you get in here? We need to talk. We don't have anything to talk about. I'll call the police. Let's talk about Artie. What do you have to do with him? Do you know him well? I do. So, do you really think he loved you? What are you saying? What a night fool you are. He was with you just to keep a job in the newspaper. Artie really loved me! Stupid! Hey! Take it easy! I just wanted to say that Artie was a complete idiot. Not as good as you thought he was. Go away. Get out now, okay? Okay, I'm leaving. I am really glad that the doctors let you go, Paul. Nothing serious. A couple of body cleansing procedures. Vitamins. I'll be okay. Your girl is very smart. She has the instinct of a detective. Boss. What's up with this drug gang? Have they been arrested? You know... That's exactly what I wanted to talk to you. What happened? Sivun claims that you cooperated with them, Paul. What a jerk. You know that it's not true. But you know... You can't avoid inspection. Well, thank you very much, boss. I never thought that my boss wouldn't trust me and will check on Calm me. down. Not everything is in my hands. They are gonna check you for sure. So, you have to be quiet as a mouse, understand? You get it? Paul, you have to drink this. What is it? You need to drink a lot now. 
This is cranberry juice. Very useful and tasty. <sighs> It's very good. Mm. You have a fever. Come on, you have to get into bed now. It's okay. The doctor said that it might happen after that junk was injected into me. Do you want me to call a doctor? Mm. No need. It's going to be okay. I... I'll be okay soon. Anya. Mm. Listen, Anya. I think it's better for you to leave the city now, for a while. But why? For your own safety. You see, this story is not over yet. And I don't know what will happen next. No, Paul, I'm not going anywhere. You don't understand. This is very serious. If something happens to you... Paul, something happened to you already. And I am here to help you, too. So I am staying. You don't understand. What are you trying to say? I can't a second time. A second time what? fiance three years ago. She was killed. These articles are ready for printing. That's it. You can go. Sergey, the point is, I wanted to apologize, but... Unfortunately, I won't be able to finish my Evsky's article. But why? You see, because the material is fake. So you're saying his article is fake? Mm hmm. Do you want to do it from the beginning? Unfortunately, I can't do it for personal reasons. If you don't mind, I will ask Senia to finish it. Hmm. It's okay. Sure? <laughs> yeah. Paul, put it back. Oh, yes, 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 sorry. I was just looking. Have you heard anything about the... Mayevsky case? Come on, Paul. Are you back in business already? I'm doing okay, yeah. Oh, you know, crime has gotten completely out of hand. Look at you. You just recovered, and you are already working really hard. Great, so we have no clue what's happening then. Don't rush. Here, look. Who is this woman? Another of Mayevsky's girlfriend. Wow. Yeah? I see the guys didn't waste any time. Yeah. Well done. I did this personally. Really? Yeah. Actually, it's none of my business, but I've been looking at my archives a little. She's Martha Smolyakova, experienced drug addict, got caught a couple of times at your favorite club. Yeah, I used to go there often. Well, I have to go again. Well done, Koss. By the way, despite the unisex style of the sneakers, a trace which we found in Mayevsky's apartment indicates it's a female. That's very interesting. Mm, and well? Here you go. There's nothing interesting here. The only thing you can see is the disc. Mm. What is this encryption? Where? Interesting. Uh, can you print this? Yeah, wait. Mm hmm Well, this is most likely to date. 
Mm -hmm. I don't know about the rest. And that number one? Where? Here at the top. I have no idea. Garrick. Martha? What's up? Why the bandage? It's nothing serious. I thought you left. Well, after Artie's... I tried, but no one's waiting for me at home. Do you have a smoke? Well, I'm going... home. What? Have you decided? Listen. I have a very interesting question for no, you. No, Martha. No, I'm done. Just listen, okay? No. It is a good one. Artie got a lot on this. Artie? What is this? Some movies. Very exciting content. The main characters are children of wealthy parents. He was also engaged in blackmail? He was engaged in everything. He knew how to live. Well, yeah, he was killed because of this. He knew how to live. Why do you need me? Well, listen. The information is encrypted. I don't know. It has a password. I can unlock it. I need to have access. Can you do it? No, I can't. Shit. Martha. I have someone who can. How much you pay? 30%. No. 50 and I'll do it today. It's a deal. Anya? Yeah? There's a guy here looking for you. Wait, I'll be right back. Yeah, yeah, I knew the Audi called by 10. Yeah. Hello? Hey. Uh, I got something. Here. What is it? Artist work. Blackmail material. You will see. Uh... Don't ask me where I got it. I don't want to set up anyone else. It's coded, but I think you can hack it. Thank you. No, thanks to you. Why me? I realized that this is enough for me. Well, take care. You too. Bye. Bye. Excuse me. Hey, what do you drink? Hello. I don't drink. May I sit? Hey, listen, I'm looking for a girl. Martha Smolyakova. She's here often. Martha. She's short hair and redheaded? No, she's not a redhead. She's dark blonde. She has a cast on her right arm. Martha, Martha. Cast on her arm. I don't know. You sure? Well, maybe. I do. But I haven't seen her for a long time. Okay, thank you. He was a cop and he was looking for you. So what? He didn't find me. I'll just wait for Gary can leave. Get out of here. I don't want trouble. Maybe it's because of Mayevsky. But how do I know? Maybe it's you. <laughs> you mean I killed. 
You're scared, huh? Well, men are even worse than women. Hello, Martha. Uh, if a cop is looking for someone, he will find them. Let me go, you dirty cop! Let me go! Is this a stirring contest? Are you going to interrogate me or what? I'm glad that the night in the bullpen worked out for you. It's time for you to have a constructive conversation. No way, cop. Have you checked the hospital? Did I lie to you about the hand? No, it's been confirmed. With a fracture like yours, you really couldn't have beat Artie Majewski to death. You were telling the truth. There you have it. That's it. Can I leave now? What am I doing here? We are waiting for the result of the identification of the victims of your blackmail. With this guy, Artie Majewski. By the way, we have a list with their names. I don't know what this is. What makes you think that I'm going to help you? I think you will because we have the video right here. Garrick Sufanov. You better help us now. The sooner we identify those blackmailed by Artie, the sooner we will find the killer. And it may help you somehow. I want to smoke. No smoking. Okay, you listen now. Artie sold drugs to the children of very wealthy people. And when they were stoned, he filmed them. Give me names. I will, okay? I'll tell you everything. I just want to warn you. I don't know everyone's name. And this... The first letters in the list, I think, are initials. Where'd you get the disc from? You were looking for it when you tried to get in Majewski's apartment, weren't you? Weren't you? Yes. But I didn't find it. Ari was clever and probably made a copy, hid it somewhere. And then I remember about his girlfriend. Pali Lavrova? If you know, why do you ask me? She is, by the way, also included in the list. Sergey, excuse me, I just wanted to ask you something about the article. Not now. Not now, next time. Oh, uh, okay. Anya, uh, um, I wanted to ask you, I want this investigation, how is it going? Ah, uh, well, it's going well. They found out that Artie was also engaged in blackmail. The police also have some materials with compromising evidence. Are you okay? Do you want me to... Shall I call an ambulance? No, 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 no. Please go. But... Please. Uh... uh no, 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 no. Please. Are you ready? Get bigger. Try it. I can try. Look. What a surprise. Here's the bride. Is there only one file? 
Yes, one. But this is the most interesting one. Thank you, man. Honey, you need to leave now. You have to go. But where? It doesn't matter where. You are going uh, far away from here. You need to... You need to get dressed. Dad, I'm not going anywhere. That's it. Yeah. Then get dressed in the car. Go now, I said! Hurry up! Uh. Are you going somewhere? Listen, I'm at Lavrov's apartment. Get here. Anya, just wait. Let me get this off. What the hell are you doing he here? He went to the airport with Polly. No one's here. Listen, everyone. Plant intercept with traffic police and border guards. They're going to the airport, got it? Right away, sir. What are you doing here? Lavrov behaved strangely when I told him about blackmail, so I wanted to see. Did you see something, Anya? Yeah. I'm gonna. Forgive me. I'm sorry. Sorry. Where is my dad? Don't think about your dad now, just yourself. We checked your alibi. The cinema staff remembered you. You waited at the entrance for a long time, phoned someone, and then left. So what? You called Mayevsky. We checked your phone call list. That evening you were supposed to go to the cinema with him, but he didn't come, so you went to his place. And you were with him at about the same time that he was killed. So what? I think your dad knew this. That's why he covered for you. When he said that he was at the cinema with you that evening. But he was just lying. Here's the last evidence. Traces of tea from the crime scene were found on your sneaker, Polly. That night, you were at Artie Majewski's apartment. Whatever. Whatever you say. So you don't care? Very nice. Then take a look at this. What's this? I didn't do it. Don't remember. People usually don't remember what they do while they're under the influence. I get it now. What do you get? Polly, this situation is serious. Motive and evidence all fit together. If you tell me everything now, maybe I can, uh...
What happened, boss? Listen, things are like this. While you were talking to Polly, her father asked me for a meeting and confessed the crime. Lavrov? Yeah. You saw your father leave Artie's apartment that evening, didn't you? I didn't understand why it's all because of me. Daddy, Daddy. Uh, yeah. Majewski blackmailed me. He threatened to put my daughter in jail, and at the same time, he was dating her. He left me no choice but to run. That's why you didn't pay attention to his fake articles. Uh, what could I do? I was powerless. But when he decided to marry my daughter, uh, it was too much. It was just too much. You can go on, please. I entered his apartment to find compromising evidence and destroy it. To try and live a normal life. But Artie came home and found you there. Where the cat dragged in. My future father in law. It will never happen. Never, you hear me? Are you gonna stop me? You are looking for a video. Isn't that right? Well, you're not gonna find it, okay? Paul is mine now. Leave my daughter alone. She is no longer yours. Now I am the only one. If I tell her I found you here, you are done, my friend. Soon she will find out what kind of person you are. Too late, Pops. You lost her. And when I get tired of her, I'll put her on drugs again, and then I'll make yeah. sure that she... Yeah. I don't remember how I got out of there or where I was going. When I came to my senses, I had the, I had the kettle in my hand. <laughs> and I threw it into the water. What about the evidence? I didn't even remember about it. You came back for it the next day. Yes, I took the chance. I took the hard drive and all the discs in which this recording could be stored, and I burned everything. I thought I destroyed everything, but... <sighs> but I guess he had a backup somewhere else. You're saying that you didn't know about the compromising evidence kept in your apartment? Of course not. If I knew, I probably wouldn't be here right now. But I... But I don't regret what I did. I would do it again if I had the chance. If such monsters appear in this world, there must be someone to try to stop them. You know? I think... The court will consider the extenuating circumstances. I 
Anya. Uh huh. Listen. Yeah. Hello. Well, hello. I have some good news. Tell me. The video of Polly is fake. What? The video's fake? So it means Polly didn't kill anyone? Yes. Artie Majewski was a master of all trades. He just altered the video. He did something and designed it so he could blackmail Lavrov. And Lavrov believed that. <sighs> Actually, you know, sometimes I have cases when I regret that it's been solved. See you off. See me up? Are you serious? Garrick, do you have. Uh, what? Coke. Polly, listen to me. Please don't start again. I gave up drugs. I did. I gave up drugs. Do you hear? You can do it too. I, can you hear me? I hear you. You can do it. Got it. Polly. Want to go with me, maybe? Maybe. 